Welcome to Graphic Island Tutorial. Today we will create social media post by following the ratio 1 is to 1. So first let's do the page setup. Go to the file, new and here give the page resolution. I am taking here 1000 pixel in width and 1000 pixel in height. So this will form 1 is to 1 ratio and then create it. Once you are done with the page setup, now from the toolbar take this rectangular tool and here draw a square using shift alt key and drag it. Let's change the fill color so that it would be visible to you in white background and let's remove the outline color for this. Now rotate it using shift key and take this one here and from here vertically align center. Now drag this one using Alt key and make a duplicate. Drag it down using Shift Alt key. And take this one here. Let me drag it inside more using Shift key. Now from the toolbar take this pan tool and draw a straight line by following the outline of this square. Drag it using Shift Alt key and extend the line like this. Select this line and drag it using Alt key and make a duplicate and place it here. Drag it once again and place it here. Drag it again using Alt key and make a duplicate. Here leaving some gap up to this much, leave it here. Now select this one and this one using Shift key and drag it using Alt key and place this one here. Select this one and this one, drag it using Alt key and make a duplicate and then rotate it using Shift key. And take this one here. Let's take this one here. Now select this one and this one, drag it using Alt key and make a duplicate and place it here. Drag it using Alt key and make a duplicate and place this one here. Now drag this one using Alt key and place this one here. Now from the toolbar take this rectangular tool and click here. Here give 1000 and 1000. The same resolution we have given for this artboard and OK. Align horizontally and vertically center. You can change the color as well, it doesn't matter. Now select this one and right click on your mouse, arrange and send this to back. Now select them all. From the toolbar take this shape builder tool, change the color Let's take black in color and make the shape from here to here, here and here. And this one from here to here, this one from here to here. And let's delete this one. Using Alt key you can delete it like this. And here let's make a shape from here to here. Now let's delete those lines and unnecessary elements. Now drag this one using Alt key and make a duplicate and place it here. Drag it down using Shift and Alt key and make the size smaller and bring this one here. Change the color to white. Select this one. Go to object, path, offset path. Here give negative offset and check it. So this much of gap we need here. Let's increase the gap a little more. OK. And choose the offset color the same like this. Now take the rectangular tool once again and here give the same resolution as like artboard and OK. And align horizontally and vertically center. 
let's choose the white color now do right click on your mouse arrange and send to back now from the toolbar take this rectangular tool and here draw a rectangle like this and rotate it using shift key take this one here so here we'll place our logo now select them take shape builder tool and delete this extended portion now go to the file open and open the images that you want to apply on your design let me drag those images to my artboard and leave it here similarly drag this one and take in your artboard let me drag this one as well and leave it here Select this one, go to edit, copy, edit, paste in place and change the color to white. Take this image here and drag it and make the size bigger. Now select this one and this one and make a mask now take this one here and drag it little more let me give some transparency so that we can see the background shape okay now it is fine select this one and from here lock it now select this background shape, do right click and arrange, bring to front. Change the color to white. Now select this one and this one and make mask. Take this one at the front. Now take this one here and make the size smaller. Select this one and change the color to white. Select this and this using shift key and from here make a mask. Arrange and bring this one to the front. Let me apply one more image. Let me add this image as well. So let me take this one here. Send this one to the back. Make the size smaller select this one change the color to white and select this one using shift key and make a mask and bring this one to the front take this shape at the front now select this one and apply gradient color Now select this one and this one. Here give the transparency up to 0%. Select this one and apply the color. Now select this down object and bring this one to the top. Choose black color and give the transparency. Now let's write some text over this using text tool. Here you can write your own details. Take text tool, 
drag it and make a text box and write your business details here. Similarly, keep adding your necessary details on the design. Drag it using Alt can make a duplicate. Control D and repeat it. Now drag our logo to the design. You can use your own logo. Now select the background rectangle and apply gradient color to it. Here mix up two different color. Add white color on the other node. And fix the gradient color angle like this. Let's give some transparency. now it looks fine select this one go to effect and here apply the shadow let's refix the gradient color angle of the background once again digital marketing social media post design is ready now i hope you understand the complete tutorial and here I am Abul Mansur. See you next video. Have a nice day.